Yo, 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 what is going on, everybody? It is D Man coming back at it again with another YouTube video. And today we've got Ryan Tannehill gameplay. He needed an upgrade, he finally got one. If you guys are new, go ahead, drop a sub, leave a like on the video, it helps me out tremendously. But let's go ahead and hop into the lineup here. Uh, now, with Ryan Tannehill, there are a couple things that you know I want to talk about with him. I do have 6 AP on him, but, you know, obviously it's a gameplay video, so I'm going to put as, uh, as much stuff as I can on him. Um, I went ahead, if you guys, you know, see my coin count, it's the same, um, because I grinded the challenges. I got the 95 overall for free. I powered him up to the 96, and he's chemmed up to a 98 on the theme team. But look at these stats, guys. Wow. Great card here. 90 deep accuracy. Just hits the th uh, threshold there. Uh, 95 throwing the pressure, 97 throwing the run, 99 play action. He's got 91 speed too as well with 99 throw power, 95 short, 97 medium. Very nice looking guard here. Now, the one thing I, want, I do want to say is he does not get Gunslinger. But don't worry, guys. He he has to get a Team of the Week up plus one overall. There is no way he doesn't. He had the best quarterback rating in all of football in Week 15. Uh, he also had five total touchdowns, I think like 350 yards or something like that. Pretty insane. He has to get his when we played the Lions. So he had one of the best games, um, you know, of the year for, you know, his 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 play. Um, and, you know, he has to get that plus one. Now, that plus one, what it will do, it will make him a 99 overall on the theme team. He'll be kimmed up to a 99 because he'll be a 97. And then he'll probably be, you know, plus two overall with the chemistries we want to run play fake and a sprinter. Uh, so with those chemistries, he should get up to 99. Now, obviously, this is all, you know, I'm guessing, you know, I'm guessing. Um, that's, that's, you know, but most likely that will happen because there's, he kind of got robbed of Gunslinger, guys. He, he should have had, they gave him 93 throw power, powered up to 94. And he's one short of throw power. But if he does get the plus one overall in Team of the Week, he will get Gunslinger. Not only will he get Gunslinger, he will also get Escape Artist at a 97 overall. That is ridiculous. Probably, he will probably be one of the best, he might be the best quarterback in the game if he does get a plus one overall. I'm just hoping and praying that he does get a plus one overall. Uh, because with Gunslinger, Escape Artist, and, you know, whatever else we want to put on him, that, that would be pretty glitchy. Um, but, yeah, Ryan Tannehill. And then also he'll be a 99 on the theme team. Man, this car will be insane. But we're still going to get a gameplay with him today. I'm running Pocket. Uh, let's go back to upgrades here. I'm running, uh, you know, Bazooka. Why not throw, uh, you know, X-Factor out there. Running uh, Bazooka, Pocket, Deadeye, Pass Lead Elite, and Sefi Lead. I haven't seen pass lead elite i'm gonna try it out it is 3 ap obviously this is not gonna be I'm, i might change i'm obviously gonna change stuff up because i'm not gonna have six ability points on my on my top on my uh, uh quarterback uh but i'm gonna try this stuff out see how it works i might keep you know some of these but we'll have to mix it in with you know obviously i'm not running any um any abilities on my running back and stuff like that but this 10 hill card looks really good other than the fact that he can't get gunslinger um, that's the one thing that holds him back, but hopefully he does get that plus one overall next week because they're doing week 14 and week 15 on Tuesday. So if he does get a, you know, a plus one, it should be, you know, next Tuesday. So and I, then I'll have a gameplay out if he does get that plus one because that plus one overall will be huge. I'm talking like that would be the biggest plus one upgrade of the year for any card because then he'll get Gunslinger and Escape Artist, which I think might be the only quarterback in the game that gets that. Um... Yeah, I think it will, because I think Rich Gannon, he's only 96 powered up. So he he was not he was not able to get escape. I think he will be the only player except for Michael Vick, maybe. Uh, yeah, I think Michael Vick gets Gunslinger, but it's like for 4 AP or something like crazy like that. T Tannehill might be the best quarterback in the game if he gets that plus one. One more thing is, we'll back out here. We did get a Rashawn Evans on defense, and, you know, I was so upset with that selection. You know, for our defensive, you know, uh, uh, you know, playoffs card, I was hoping for an Adore Jackson. Um, I was hoping for an Adore Jackson or a, you know, any quarterback at this point. Malcolm Butler would have been fantastic. You know, 
Rashawn Evans, he does not get, you know, a power up. We already have him in the lineup here. He's an 81 overall as a gold card. Uh, so he'll probably be a 97 overall middle linebacker, which is nice. Um, but obviously, much more needed upgrade here at cornerbacks. You know, we, we do need an upgrade at cornerback. We just, that is a must right now on defense. Now, I'm hoping Finnegan gets a, you know, a legend card. Maybe not a legend card, but something that'll give him, you know, probably like a 95, 96 overall later down the road. That'll get him up to like a 99 overall with probably 99 speed. So that would be nice, but we still need some other upgrades at cornerback. Like, you know, like I said, Adore Jackson, Desmond King still needs his upgrade. We do have Jason McCourty uh, sitting in the binder as well. So those are a couple others we got We got to have upgrades for. Um, that's just point blank simple. We got to have upgrades to our cornerbacks or, you know, it's really tough. You're going to have to run zone a lot. You can't man up these guys because they're so slow. Um, you even can get, yeah, I get burnt over the top sometimes by just, you know, Tyreek Hill running straight down the middle of the field. Um, it's just tough. Tough to play with these type of cornerbacks, um, but we do need upgrades. EA, we need upgrades at cornerback. We are fine at middle linebacker. We are fine at outside linebacker. We are fine. Defensive line is fine. It's Everything's fine. We just need cornerbacks. That's the one thing we need on defense um, pretty much for the whole team. Now, we do need a right tackle, but once we get that Saffold upgrade, he will fill that spot out for me. I might move uh, Bruce Matthews out to the right tackle and then put well, – we'll see what happens then. Uh, but, yeah, let's go ahead and hop into the gameplay. It's all about Ryan Tannehill this uh, this video, so let's go ahead and see how he plays. All right, guys, hopping into this game. There was our top three right there. I'm not sure if you guys saw it, but he has DK. So we get to play against the new no, – oh, my gosh, can't speak. We get to play against the new DK. We got the new Ryan Tannehill. So let's see if we can go ahead and get this dub. If you guys do remember, Ryan Tannehill, way back in the series of our Titans theme team, you know, episodes, he led us to a Super Bowl, uh, and he pretty much won us the Super Bowl. We did get that Mariota upgrade early in the year, and I used him in the Super Bowl, but we were able to win, and Tannehill was the quarterback that season. His gold card led us all the way. Let's see if he can, if he can do it again, and we've got Randy Moss streaking down the sideline. Tannehill's first play is a touchdown to Randy Moss and wow he scored on his first drive and I scored right back and he pauses the game and he quit wow we'll take it all right guys hopping into the next game there's our top three Tannehill is in our top three that is beautiful he's not the best squad but hey I have lost some people that have you know not the best team so we're not gonna say anything let's go ahead let's get another win here all right guys Second possession for Ryan Tannehill out here on offense. That scoreboard looks a little funky, I know. Uh, he did go ahead and score. He went for two, and actually I picked it off with Sam Mills, and we took it to the house. So I know it looks a little funky, but it is what it is. Let's go ahead and put some more points up on the board. Uh, and he sees that Moss route, but his guys are just too slow, and I lobbed that one up. Uh, and But Tannehill is accurate. I should have bulleted that, but uh, we're definitely going to be able to beat this guy over the top. He's not obviously... Has some slow players out there on the field. And he's going to have to come out and cover three. We might start seeing if we can scramble out here with, uh, oh my goodness. John who's got a step right there over the top. That's going to be another six points on the board. Three plays for Tannehill, and he's got two touchdowns right there. So we will definitely take that. Obviously, we're not playing the best squad, but hey, we're still going to put up some nice numbers with Ryan Tannehill. Let's see if we can go ahead. No, no. We are not going to be able to knock that one through with Greg Joseph. But that scoreboard looks so weird. But we are taking a two-point lead right now. Let's see if we can get a stop. All right, third possession with Mr. Tannehill at quarterback. Another interesting fact, if you guys didn't know, it's been it's the 21st anniversary of the Music City Miracle. So 21 years since that happened is pretty crazy. And we're going to hit Moss once again. Uh, but Tannehill does feel really good with that, you know, set feet lead. Um, can't get, I mean, obviously I want the gunslinger, but, you know, every time he lights up for me, when I see, the, you know, the ball thrown, it feels a whole lot better than Vince Young. Uh, but there goes Tannehill once again, another touchdown, and we are going to be able to knock this one on through to make it a nine-point lead. All right, guys. Bazooka is activated on Ryan Tannehill. Not like he needs it. He has 99 throw power, but he still does go ahead and get Bazooka. And let's see if we can fit this right over the middle to Jonu Smith. Man, that that is beautiful. That is beautiful. Now, obviously, like I said before, we aren't playing the best team. Um, 
you know, but we're still going to go out here with Tannehill and put up some pretty nice numbers. We do have uh, Vince Young still at backup. Now, we have Vince Young at backup, and we can still, you know, once we, the episode tomorrow, uh, you know, for the Titans team team, we might go ahead and, you know, mix it up and put Vince Young out there for some read options. That's going to be nice having Vince out there, um, but also Tannehill can go ahead and get the read option, too. He has 91 speed, so, hey, what well, might have to try that out this video, too. It's time to have a little fun, guys. We are up a lot on, on this guy. So we're going to try a little read option with Ryan Tannehill, see if he can get loose. I don't care if he's going to make the right read. Tannehill gets around that end pretty easily. Can we go out there and get a block? Oh, he gets hit stick, but we'll take it. Let's go no huddle. Uh, we shouldn't be going no huddle because Tannehill could easily fumble this ball, but we're still going to try it here. Another option play. Oh, my God, Tannehill's slow. we got to call timeout here and get his stamina back here. All right, let's try the read option. It's a little different play here. we got John who coming across, picking up the block uh but let's see if we can get loose with Tannehill once again he's gonna go in with a run and Tana will Tana wills baby we love to see it can he outrun the safety I don't know oh no we can't but we'll take a big game there three rushes for Tanny 57 yards let's run it again he might be tired uh but I don't care we're gonna run this thing one more time here I don't care if he makes the right read oh my goodness y'all see how slow he is Oh, no. Uh, we could have easily fumbled that. We got to call another timeout. <laughs> Did y'all see how slow he was running there? Let's go ahead. Let's let's get back to the pass game. Let's go ahead and run Saints drags again. Why not? It's been, you know, it's been dominant the whole game, the whole video pretty much. So let's see if we can go ahead and hit Johnny on the inside um, or on the outside there. Johnny in the end zone, and that's going to be another six points put up on the board for us. But, hey, we got to have a little fun somehow when we, you know, blowing out people like this. Uh, so, you know, we got to run the read option maybe a little bit, have a little bit of fun. Uh, but we do go up 28-6 to six on this guy. And we're going to go ahead and kick our extra point here with Greg Joseph. Um, and, yeah, that's going to go ahead and go on through. Now, another guy, another thing that they were talking about in the playoff promo is that we might be getting, it's, it's like there's more drops coming in uh, throughout the, you know, the promo has multiple drops. So hopefully we'll see um, some more upgrades down the road. Uh, hopefully we do win against Baltimore and get some more upgrades down the road, but that's what you know. That's what I'm hoping for. All right, we're gonna try play action. This is what Tannehill is known for: play action passes. So we're gonna try and see if we can hit someone. Um, Calico's there. Let's go ahead and dump it off to Cal. Oh, no, that was not a good pass on the run there from Tannehill. All right, another little play action. Uh, you know, play here. We're gonna try. Oh my God, Class Campbell comes screaming. Um, can we get something glitchy here? Oh, I was going to try and step out of bounds there, but we weren't able to. But Tannehill still five rushes, 65 yards with like four touchdowns to go with it. We'll definitely take that. All right, guys, he just paused the game. He didn't have a pause there in the first half. Right when the second half came through, he went ahead and paused it pretty quickly. He's out of there. But that is going to do it for the gameplay video. We're going to have him tomorrow, too. So Tannehill gameplay coming tomorrow with the Titans theme team episode. Uh, so yeah, hopefully, and we'll have Rashawn Evans, uh, you know, to go along with Tannehill tomorrow. Maybe we do get a legend upgrade. Who knows? Maybe they go with Ultimate Legends this week, and I have no idea. We'll have to wait for you know the re or reveal tonight on you know Madden Ultimate Team's Twitter, uh, and I'll definitely have a video out tonight going over the new legends that are coming tomorrow. Um, but last week they did go ahead and only announce one or reveal one. And then we had to wait for Kyle Williams in the morning on, on Saturday morning. So we really didn't even know who the defensive player was until we loaded up Madden, uh, you know, Ultimate Team at 9.30 on Saturday last week. So they could do it the same. I think they're going to reveal both of them. Uh, another thing is we are getting Series 4 for next Friday. So next Friday, if you have any LTD cards, I'm going to go ahead and sell off my Harold Landry next week sometime. Um, also, if I have any other, I'm trying to think of any other LTD cards I have. I don't think I have any LTD cards unless we do go ahead and get, um, if we do go ahead and get, uh, oh my goodness, I'm drawing a blank. If we go ahead and get, I, actually, if we go ahead and get a, a, an LTD card next week, I don't think it'll be, you know, they won't redux, you know, this week weekend's Legends. Um, but hopefully, maybe a Cortland Finnegan Legend card. I know that's kind of a... A stretch there, maybe a Drew Bennett legend card. They were going, you know, they were doing, you know, the team diamond upgrades there with the legend promo. So maybe we do see a Drew Bennett. I'll definitely have gameplay on him tomorrow. Um, but yeah, hopefully we get that Ryan Tannehill plus one. That's the really big thing that I'm hoping for. 
uh, next week for the team of the week. But yeah, they guys, that is going to do it. Tannehill went off. What he had like six, seven touchdowns and like what, 100 yards on the ground. That was pretty fun to play with Tannehill there. Um, but yeah, I really hope he gets Gunslinger. Hopefully, he gets that plus one overall. But yeah, guys, that's going to do it for the video. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy. Go ahead, leave a like, drop a sub for me. It really helps me out a lot. And yeah, till next time. I'll see y'all.